Hey, do you struggle in managing your time? We all have 24 hours in a day, but have you wondered how some of them are able to maximize their time while others don't? I mean, what is it that they do that you're not? And what is your biggest time waster? In today's video, I want to talk to you about some of the biggest, top most time wasters that are eating into your time and you're not even aware of it. So if this topic interests you, keep watching. If you're new to me and this is the first time here, a very warm welcome to you. My name is Aparna. I'm a certified coach helping people upskill themselves to lead the life they desire. And I do that by sharing tips, tricks, tools and hacks every week that can help you upskill your life. And if this interests you, consider subscribing to my channel and while you're there, do not forget to hit the bell button so you're notified every time I post a new video, which is every Thursday. And if you're not new to me, thank you so very much for returning. Your support and guidance helps me stay consistent in bringing out fresh content every single week. We're talking about managing your time effectively and today I want to draw your attention to some of the biggest time wasters that are eating into your time and you're probably not even aware of them. The first one on my list is multitasking. Yes, you heard me right. Doing many things in one go is actually a waste of time and I have been committing this crime repeatedly over several years. You see, I was really proud of the fact that I can do a lot of things at one go, but I only realized that it's not just wasting my time, but also putting on undue stress on me. So I've done this experiment where I've multitasked and I've also compared that to a single tasking, which is doing things one by one. And you know what? I actually saved a lot of time doing single tasking and I just couldn't believe it. So if you're a multitasking junkie like me, I want you to experiment and see how much time does single tasking save for you. And do let me know in the comments below whether it worked out for you or no. The second one on my list is a smartphone. If you rolled your eyes, then I'm sorry. This is an absolute fact. And the reason I said smartphone and not social media, because typically when we talk about time wasters, social media is sort of fitting right up there. But when I say smartphone, I not just talk about social media, but also your mails and calls and text messages and to the gaming apps that, that you don't really want to go, but you're drawn to go because that's how they make them. And all that distraction that this phone is causing us. Now, I will talk about solution for this issue in the next episode. But for now, I want you to be aware how much time are you really spending on your phone? And if you want to know your answer, honestly, you may open the settings in your phone and look at the screen time and that gives you an absolute figure. Number three on my list is speaking without thinking. Now I am from the express yourself generation and you know what that means which means I want to be able to express myself without having trouble of not caring about what others think, not wanting to be held back. However, I know I spent a lot of time in explaining people, myself to people, as to what I meant with those words. Because typically when we express ourselves in anger or frustration, you tend to use words which are not really something that you want to. And once spoken, words once spoken cannot be taken back. So when you know that there is going to be repercussions of the word that you say, it's better to give it a little bit of thought before you actually say it. I have been doing the same thing, you know, posting something and then regretting as to, okay, maybe I need to, to post it, but in a different way. Maybe I needed to clarify in a different way. You see, all this is a waste of time. So the next time you want to say something or post something online, do give it a little thought and consider if it is important for you to say it. If it is, then go ahead by all means and be very, very clear in your communication so that there is no perceptions or assumptions that can be drawn out of what your message is. We're talking about time wasters. Number four on my list is overthinking. The amount of time that we waste in overthinking is mind-boggling. Truly, 
because when we think too much instead of acting it out or doing things then you are not just wasting your time but a lot of your energy you end up feeling anxious and frustrated all the time and that can result into affecting your mental health so ask yourself am i overthinking overthinking doesn't mean that you're just sitting and thinking you know okay what do i do? no it isn't that that's not happening what's really happening is you are scrolling aimlessly on your phone or you may probably doodling in something but you are doing some other action but your mind is thinking and looping the same thing again and again and as, as i keep saying it awareness is a first crucial step to any change so be aware and mindful if you are indeed overthinking because if you are i've already spoken on how you can stop overthinking and the link to that video is flashing on the screen right now and i will also provide that in the description below final one on my list is comparing yourself to others and this is the worst form of time waster because this results ultimately into negative self-talk and after that it's just downhill every one of us have battles to fight which means nobody has it easy when you compare yourself or your accomplishments to someone you're putting your focus on a wrong person this can lead to anxiety, frustration, and even resentment towards that person. So if you're comparing yourself with anyone at all, try to recognize what it is doing to you. Like I said before, you cannot stop or change any habit unless and until you're aware that it happens or exists in your life. Three things that you cannot recover in life. The word after it's said, the moment after it's missed, and the time after it's gone. So these are the top five time wasters you need to watch out for, which you're probably not aware that exist in your life. Number one is multitasking. Number two is time spent on your smartphone. Number three is speaking or posting without thinking. Number four is overthinking. And number five is comparing yourself to others. Have you known about these before? What do you think is your biggest time waster? Do let me know in the comment section below or you may reach out to me in any of the social media platforms that I'm in. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, do hit a like button, share it with your friends. And of course, if you consider subscribing to my channel, subscribe and also hit the bell button so you never miss an update from me. I'll see you next week. Until then, take good care of yourself. Bye.